What is up everybody? Welcome back to Level Up Classics, where we maintain, modify, and restore some of our favorite classic cars. Today's video is going to be a little bit different. More story time and how I finally cleaned and organized my detailing and car care supplies. So let's get you from messy to sexy. For the longest time, I've been looking for a way to organize all my detailing crap. After looking at my mess, my supplies are scattered everywhere. And I finally gave in and I started looking for a cart. So I came across this detailing cart on Amazon and then I was like, what the heck? Some of these carts, they all look the same. It turns out that I found this rebranded detailing cart from Bike Master and it's got excellent reviews and it's been rebranded by a few companies out there. This is the cheapest cart at 80 bucks, but this is the exact same cart sold by other companies and well-known detailing, not gonna name any names, but detailing brand companies. And these go all the way up to 140 bucks. It's literally the exact same besides the sticker label. Anyways, I was so excited to get this cart and I wanted to share it with you guys too. Stupid things like this excite me now these days. So let's put it together. It's super easy. Open the box. It comes with three trays. The legs, the wheels, two locking wheels, two regular wheels, tray dividers, some trim pieces, caps for the holes, and some tapping screws. Go ahead and toss the instructions because you don't need those because that's what this video is for. So first we're going to shove the legs into the tray. Make sure they're straight and then just push down on them. You can use a mallet but just make sure you don't damage the legs. All right, so once you get these legs in, you wanna make sure that your cart is level to the ground. Make sure everything's nicely pressed in evenly. And then what I did here is I put my body weight down and I kind of push it in so it's really good in there. Now we're gonna put on the caps. There's four caps on top and four caps on bottom. Next, we're going to put in the wheels. The wheels you need to firmly press down on. You're going to have two regular wheels and two locking wheels. Make sure the locking wheels are on the same side as each other. Also, I put a carpet on the floor just so I don't scratch the top of the cart. I screwed that one up big time. Get it? Now using an impact driver, we're going to tap the screws into the legs. There's two little holes in each section where the screws go. Now here we're going to put in the dividers and the trim pieces. All in all, I'm glad I picked up this car. This car rolls very smoothly and I can fit a ton of stuff on here. Last but not least, peel off the label and put on your own sticker. And now, I got my own RWB Sacramento detailing cart and a clean cabinet. 
If you like this card and you want to get one too, I put my affiliate links below. This is not a sponsored video and I buy all my stuff myself. If you buy something from the links below, I may get a small commission to help support my channel. It's no cost to you, but it's like saying thanks for pointing me in the right direction. So I hope you grab one of these too and you get everything all organized. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to hit the like button and subscribe for more content to come.